Oh, Doctor Fell. You really had to go there, didn't you? Well, we're all in the mood for a melody. Thank you for calling. <coughs> I'm sorry. Thank you for calling. <coughs> sorry, that swallowed my coke wrong. Uh, yes, I have a, <coughs> a message from Amazon saying that uh, my Amazon order has been cancelled for suspicious activity. So what is going on with that? Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of weird. Can you help me? Can you help with the order number, sir? Yes. It's uh, AMZ. Please tell me the order number. AMZ. It's not an Amazon. What? It's not an Amazon order number, sir. It's Amazon. It's not an Amazon order number. You are... No, no, no. You are giving the wrong order number. It's not the order number. Okay. You just want the numbers then? Yeah, it's a order number. Confirm me the order number. Yes, that's what I'm gonna give you. The order number, seven seven one. Tell me the order. Seven seven one. It starts from one. That's it starts from one. That's what it has in the front. I told you that. Seven seven one three two seven, six seven, five seven. two. It has been sir. It's like it's not a complete order number. Give me the complete order number. It's like fourteen digit number. It's one. I told you it's one in the beginning, and then a zero, and then a seven. You have, you have okay. All right. And then. One zero seven seven one three two six five two one four three two. When did you got to know that your your order is today suspended to some today activity? This morning. And how much you have paid for the order? Thousand dollars. Thousand thirteen. Thousand dollar. Thousand thirteen. Okay. Thank you for confirming it, sir. Well, mm -hmm. First of all, I have to verify your account in order to get you verified. May I know which cell phone device you are using? Android. Is it an iPhone or Android? It's uh, Android. All right. Please do me a favor. Mm -hmm. All right. So mm -hmm. I have, as I told you, I have to verify uh -huh. your account. Yes. Please mm -hmm. do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Put my call on speaker and oh, on Bluetooth. Have the Play Store on your phone. Play Store. Okay. Once you open the Play Store, do let me know. It's open. Okay, now do you see search bar at the very top? Tap on that search bar. Yes. Type it there. Quick Support. It is our support application. Type it there, Quick Support. Okay. Uh, it says Team Viewer Quick Support. Is that the right one? Yes. Yes. Now okay. search for it. Alright. Do I now install it? The team Viewer support. install it, yes. Okay. Push and install. Once it says open, do let me know, okay? Okay. Alright, I'm opening it. It says I accept the EULA and the DPA. Push on accept, okay. then push on agree and continue. All right, so share this device's screen to any computer. Swipe your screen right to left. I'm just connecting you with the Amazon Secure Server in order to get you verified. Okay. Because your account is suspended. All right. Now I've got s nine digits here. Now uh, one. Tell me, no, tell me the numbers. It Four. should be ten-digit number. No, it's only nine. Confirm me the number. Six six four. One five two. Okay. Six. Okay. Five one. Thank you for confirming it, sir. Just allow me a moment. Let me connect you mm -hmm. with the Amazon verification server. Now stay on the same page. Do you see allow? So you gave me the wrong number. It's not the right one. You seem to be messed up with numbers today. I don't know what's going on with you. Uh, it's six six four one okay. five. What? Okay. Six six four one six, five six, four, one five two six five one. Okay. So it's not the right one. It's not able. Can you repeat it again? Six six four. One five two six five one. Okay. 
I believe you did it wrong. It's not. It's something like ten digit numbers, starting from one six. Okay. And as I'm seeing. No, it's not one six. Not it's not one six. I told you it's not one six. I told you it's six six four. It's not correct. It says me it's incorrect. Maybe you're giving it wrong. Maybe your system's messed up. <coughs> Anyway, what does this have to do with my account? What does what does what does this have to do with my Amazon account? I have to verify. You haven't even. You haven't even asked me for my name. That's why. So I asked about your order number. As I have the number, the number you are calling for. So what's number, so what's my name? Amazon account. So what's my name? So what's my name? I I'm couldn't able. You can't what? I couldn't able to see here until I verify the account. You can't. How are you going to verify the account if you can't see the number? I see the numbers. The numbers, which is four one nine seven seven six two four zero seven. Okay, this is the number. Say it again. You are calling from. So I have checked there. It yeah. Four one nine. Uh huh. Seven seven six two four. Okay. So what's my what's my name then? Before the verification, I couldn't able to see it. That's why I'm, I have to verify your account. That's <laughs> why I have told you. How is giving you this this team viewer thing gonna verify my account? I have no team viewer account. Team viewer will connect you with the Amazon verification server in order to get you verified. That's why. Okay. I'm Wait a minute. How here. can you explain how how team connecting to the Amazon server is gonna make me verified? Because as there is a suspicious activity on your account, that's why we have to connect you with the verification server, sir. I, I still Can don't you tell me the number which you are getting there? Yes, it's six six four one five two six five one. Explain to me how explain to me how can this team viewer is gonna connect me to the secure server of Amazon and how that's gonna identify me. Can you explain it? Talk to my manager and just transfer a call to my manager, okay? Okay. Talk to my manager. Give the numbers. Alright. Thank you for staying connected. This is Michael. How can I help you today? Yes, this uh, previous employee you have is, is very rude and uh, doesn't seem to be answering my questions properly. I don't know what his problem is. But I have this... Uh, I'm sorry on behalf. ...blocking of my order here and he doesn't want to seem to help. So let me tell you one thing that he told you to download an app so that I he did connect you to the Amazon database. Yes, what I want yeah, he, so he did you download the app and you open it. He didn't even ask me my name. Okay, you see any numbers on the quick support? Yeah, I see the numbers on the quick support, but it's not quick support, it's uh team viewer. Yeah, read it to me, read me the numbers. Six six four, one five two, six five one. It cannot be happened, sir. The numbers cannot be of a nine-digit number. Let it is a nine-digit number. And I believe you. It's a nine. I believe you're trying to make a prank. Or okay, this is really me. cute. This is really cute, Michael. This is really cute, Michael. Did you wake up today in a joking mood? How dare you say that this is a prank? Unless you're pranking me. I got this message that my, my freaking Amazon account has been suspended. And then the first guy can't answer any basic questions. <laughs> oh, they're so dumb. My gosh, they're idiots. Thank you for calling Amazon to say that. Alex, let me help you. Yeah, I got a message that my Amazon account has been suspended for fraudulent activity. Okay, let me just check it. Sir, may I have your email address that's used to log in into your Amazon, please? Yes, my name is Peter. P E T E R dot. Prickcox. P R I C K. C O X. At gmail.com. Thank you. 
And when did you receive this email? I uh, got it. I think I got it last night, but I just checked it, saw it this morning. Okay. Let me just check it. So for the verification, could you please confirm your billing address, zip code? 42141. Thank you, sir. Can you please hold the line for a minute so I can verify why you received such an email? Yes. Can you please hold the line? Yes. Thank you. Thank you for holding the line, sir. Yes, I'm here. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Okay, I just verify why you received an email because you're, there was a suspicious charge last night of $450 from your Amazon account. Wait a minute, $450? To a person named John. For what? Yes. What was purchased? Their money has been. That's what I'm telling you. The money has been transferred to a person named John Cooper in New Mexico. John Cooper? Through Amazon gift cards. Yes. Okay. Did you authorize that charge? No, I don't even know who John Cooper is. You don't know this person? No. Never heard of them. That's a that's what that's what we thought, sir. That because normally, if anyone has to send Amazon gift card, it has to be like fifty dollars, hundred dollars, maximum two hundred dollars. But no one in the earth could send four hundred fifty dollars to anyone through Amazon gift card. That's what we blocked your Amazon account for the suspicious activity. Amazon doesn't Not have gift cards. I'm gonna do one thing. I'm gonna un yes, Amazon gift cards. I thought Amazon has gift cards. With I've, bank I've, card is linked I've, to I've, I've uh, used Amazon gift cards before. Sir, yes. Normally, when anyone send Amazon gift card, it's for like fifty dollars, hundred dollars, or two hundred dollars. But from your Amazon account, the gift card that has been sent to this person is for four hundred fifty dollars, which is very expensive. No one send that through Amazon gift cards. And his That's name why is we thought that it's a suspicious transaction. Yeah, and his name is Juan Carlos Pooper. He said. No, John John Cooper. Oh, John Cooper. Okay. <coughs> I believe. We believe that this person is might be hacking into your phone. That's how he got your banking details, your uh, Amazon credentials. That's how he transferred himself four hundred fifty dollars. Do you remember downloading anything from the internet recently, or you might have visited website like Google Search, Yahoo Search, or Instagram? Yes, I just did my taxes yesterday. Do you think that has something to do with it? Because I had to. I mean, I don't know what it sent me to all kinds of weird websites. So and I was downloading like things that well, they had. Might be a possibility. Oh, that's just that great. That might be a possibility. Not an issue, sir. What I'm going to do, I'm going to cancel the charge of $450. Within the next one hour, we'll be able to activate your Amazon account. But first, we have to remove the hacking thing from your phone. So which phone you're using, Android or iPhone? Android. Okay, so do me a favor. Put the call on speaker mm -hmm. and open up Play Store on your phone. All right, um, has my phone been hacked? Well, possibility, sir, because you have done all kind of stuff for your text on your computer or phone, but they are connected to the same Wi-Fi. So we can only help you with the phone first, then we'll do it on your computer if you have any. Okay. So put the call on speaker and okay. open up. Yes. Play Store. All right. Now on Play Store, at the very top, you can see a search box which says search for apps and games. Uh -huh. Yes. Click on that and type in there any desk. Okay, any desk. Hold on. Any A N E Shouldn't I be A N Y so shouldn't sorry, I, mistake. Shouldn't I, shouldn't I re A shouldn't I reinstall the Amazon app? So that won't make any difference. Okay. Because if they're hacking into your Wi Fi network, that will be a problem. We have to fix that remotely. We have to secure your bank account that's linked with us. You have to secure your Amazon app. All right, I just installed AnyDesk. Open. Privacy okay. statement, it's whatever. AnyDesk, remote desktop. Okay, install. Uh, okay, where is it now? What you can see on the screen, you can tell me. I can I guide just, you the right way. I just shut everything down to, to open it up again. Okay, it says accessibility. Damn it, these apps are so freaking stupid. Yes, 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 sir. Listen, listen, calm down. Now it's on listen, settings. It now it's on it freaking settings. How, why can't these damn things work? Me, why is everything such a problem? Sir, can, can you please listen to me? Scroll it down, you will see any desk, 
or plugins which is off, you need to turn it on. I always see a, se a settings page. Either you will see any. I see user guide, accessibility, system updates, system, safety and emergency, Google, digital well-being, account, storage, battery. That's it. Uh, application manager, uh, extensions, location, mm -hmm. privacy, lock screen, display, notification. I'm so freaking sick of this. So sick of this. I can Just barely press the back take button. It. I press, can barely press take the back button once. Press the back button once. You did that? Sir, can you hear me? Bitch ass apps. Damn fucking app. I'm sorry, I just smashed the phone about five times. Okay. I don't see anything you're talking about. Do one thing. That's okay. Just press the back button. Go back. Can we just time. use a computer instead? Because nothing ever works on these phones. I'm so sick of this phone. You, you can use the computer, sir. Damn fucking bitch phone. I don't see anything you're talking about. I just smashed the computer on my table. Okay, just, just listen, listen. Just go back one time. Like go back, go back where? to the App Store? No, just go any desk. Open any desk again. I click on any desk and it says plug-in activated. To be able to control this device remotely, yes. a plug-in needs to be activated. I don't know what a plug-in is. Where do I activate the plug-in? Okay. I'll tell you, sir. It's so down. fucking annoying. What do I do? Hello? 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 Can you hear me? Yes, is this Amazon? Yes, sir, this is Amazon. Dude, I, I don't know what's wrong with this. It says plug-in activation. I don't know what a plug-in is. I've never had this problem okay. with a computer. Like, sir, it's can just you please calm down for a minute so I can help you shit. Read everything that you can see on that page. It says, to be able to control this device remotely, a plug-in needs to be activated. Would you like to activate this plug-in now? I don't know what a plug-in is. What does that mean? All I know what a plug is is something that plugs in the wall or it goes up someone's freaking rear end, a plug. Okay, now can you see anywhere... Like OK, continue next. I see OK. Click on OK. Now it goes to the mother effing accessibility page again. Yes, now scroll it down. Vision, hearing, <sighs> dexterity and interaction, select to speak, switch off access. I mean, what is all this crap? Sir, listen to me. Can you please calm down for a minute and read everything to me one by one? Okay. It says vision, hearing, dexterity, and intercourse. Accessibility features shortcut. Auto-rotate screen. Select to speak. Switch access. Digital secure. Uh, Bitfender mobile security. Comfort view. Ring with a vibration device. Can you see anywhere plugins 81? No, no. Plugins I see nothing. 81. I see nothing. None of these apps ever work because they're made by friggin' idiots. Okay, then go to the computer. Open computer. Hold on. God, why do people like these apps so much? I think they suck. They never work. Once you're on your computer, let me know. I'm starting up. All right, it's on now. Open a browser like Google Chrome. This better work. Google Chrome. Chrome. Open the browser. I Chrome. did. I did. I see it. Is there plugins okay. on this too? Now, yes. Now, you need to go on a website called www.ultra. U L T R A. Ultra. Viewer. V I E. W E R dot net. Yeah, I see. Ultra it. viewer dot net. 
It says forbidden. Now search for it and oh, download dot, it. Dot net. Hold on, I put dot com. Ultraviewer dot net. What is this now? That's a different software for computers. Like any desk for the phone, oh. this is a different software for the computer. All right, what is it? What am I supposed to do here? Install it. You will see install see or download. download. Let's see download. Yes, download it. All right, I guess I open it. Mm hmm. Next, 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 please. Next, install. Why mm -hmm. can't they just freaking install instead of asking all these dumb questions that no one reads? Sir, so because there are so many scams happening these days. Oh. But no one reads them anyway. <laughs> all right. So it's installing, wait for setup, installs UltraViewer on your computer. Just wait, you will see an ID number and the password. Once it installed completely. What you can see on the screen? It says, completing the UltraViewer setup wizard. Okay. It's completing now. Okay, looks like it says uh, there's an ID box that's blank and a password. Yes. 02254. Once you see the numbers in the ID box, let me know. Okay, I got, I got them. They're there. You got them? Yeah. Read it to me, the ID number first. That's it. And the password is four zero two. Yes. Okay. Now you will be getting some requests either to accept or allow something like that. Do that. I don't see anything. It says sharing audio on remote computer. Mm -hmm. What is this like Napster? Yes. Is, is this Sir, a no, Napster? It's not a Napster. It's a remote software to it's remove like the hacking things from the network. You can share songs on Allow this? it. No, no, sir. We don't share songs. Oh. Anything pops up on your screen, like asking to allow or something like that? Or continue uh, next? No, I don't see anything. Okay. I got it. Almost there. Okay. Now, open Amazon. Let me put it for you. Now we already blocked your account. You won't be able to purchase anything for next twenty-four hours. But here's another once thing. We receive... here, here, here's another problem. Why am I being shown Staple Plus fourteen sizes? You know, I, I'm sure, not. I am not thing. a fourteen plus size woman. Okay. Mm -hmm. I know that you're all woke over there and like to talk about how you know you're a woman and you like to dress like a woman and all that. But you know, I don't do that. I'm so sorry about it, sir. I'll so remove stop, that. So, stop putting evening. ads for transgenders and LGBTQs on my screen. Sir, that's not my space where I can tell you because that was done from the Amazon itself. Headquarters. Is that your email address? Please check it. Peter.prickcox.gmail.com. Yes. Thank you. Oh my God! It was well. That, that explains it. It was blocked. This is this is what I got in my freaking thing. What's your cell phone number, sir? <clears throat> four one nine. What? Seven seven six. Yeah, four one nine seven four zero oh seven. Yeah, but my account's blocked. It's not going to work. Mm -hmm. Now enter the password, sir. Do you remember the password? Yeah. Put in the password there. See, it doesn't okay. work. The password is incorrect. It's because, so you have no, to it's not. To the right they have freaking blocked my account. I told you that's what the email I, will, I got. I will, I will help you out. Wait. Trust me, I'm helping you out. So just give me a minute. See. 
same icon, same icon. This is the one. What is now that? Now check your cell phone. Check your cell phone. You received a one-time password from Amazon. Okay. You have to give me the numbers that you receive. Okay. The message that you received is from Amazon. I'm not getting anything. A text message. I didn't get anything. This computer's probably been hacked because of all the TurboTax crap I, I had to download. I will help you out, sir. And in which bank you want the refund? The name of your bank in which you want the refund? Norristown Union. Sorry, I didn't hear that. Could Norristown Credit North Union. Norristown Credit Union. North, North Town Credit Union. Yes. Rick? Yes. Can't you check on your end? Because obviously this is not working sure. on mine. I'm not getting any messages. Nothing. Okay, I will check it. I'm gonna reset it again. Should I'm gonna do a scan? How do I do a, a scan? MSG. Do you have an antivirus? Run command. Why isn't this working? Thought let me do it, sir. Let me just secure that. Amazon thing first, then you can scan it. Where's the run command? We are removing so that CMDM3. Oh, CMDM3? No, CMD only. Let me do it for you. Let me do it. C can I do it, please? CMD. There we go. Run. So that won't work that way. Scan. Sir, that won't work. Well, what's the code to enter the scan? Is it MSG? Some crap? Let me do it. Can I do it, please? Yes, please, 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 please. Everything is clear, sir. Now, because we have removed the hacking thing. That's not how you do it. That's just a path listing. You're, you're you trying to do MS config, right? MS config. Can I... No, you don't. Ha you cannot put it there. You have to put it in the search box. Let me do it for you, if you don't mind. What the hell? Now this is blocked. Sir, can you please let me do it, please? Can you let me do it? Go ahead. Can I do it for you? Go ahead. Let me just close this page. It's, wait, wait, you get, that's where you enter, msconfig. Sir, you cannot put it into the CMD command. Right there, look. Here. Why didn't it work? Go ahead, do it, sir. Why didn't because it, it work? Because it won't work here. It won't work here. Let me do it for you. You have to put it in the search box. I'm doing it. See, you got the same page I did. Oh, you got to hit boot. Okay. And if you boot you will simply wipe out the computer. What? Yes, it's, that's why I'm telling you don't boot. Now you got a text message? Yeah. Have you got the text message? Yep. Now we you close that page, I believe. It's 22718. Wait, we have to redo it because you close that page. Look, there's that again. It's plus 14 sizes. Mm -hmm. I know, sir. That's just an advertisement. Your cell phone number is 419-776-2407. Sir, can you please let me do it? Why? Because I'm the one who's fixing the issue. Yeah, but you keep you can't seem to make it work. That's what I'm trying to do, sir. It will come with your phone number. This isn't working, man. Look. Let let me do... This fucking Amazon piece of shit. I'm just going to freaking cancel it. Cancel it, please. <laughs> he was getting so pissed.